Hey team, welcome to today's hot topic. It's seriously one of my favorite topics to talk about and I know that you can relate. Today, we're gonna to be talking about setting goals and I'm gonna help you set goals in a smart way. Super excited about it, so get your pen and your book ready and let's go. first letter of SMART is S, and that is specific. How specific can you be to set a goal? This is probably the most important part when you're just starting out and setting your goal, okay? So I want you to write down exactly what your goal looks like, what it feels like. I want you to see it, I want you to visualize it, and not just in your head, but on your piece of paper, in that book that you're gonna be writing all of these wonderful things down in, okay? As specific and clear as you can. This is just for you. This is all for you. No one else will see this. So you can make this as creative as you like. I'm a very, very visual person. So I even like to put pictures down, almost like a vision board. Being as specific as you can about a goal will help you on the days that you're feeling less motivated it will help you stay dedicated to the goal that you really want to achieve because it's yours and you own it. So be specific and clear as you can. So that's going to be your first word in SMART. So you can go ahead and write that down and then leave some space where you can start being specific and clear and starting to own this goal. The second letter in SMART is M, measurable. You need to be able to measure your goal. Along the way, you're not always going to be motivated, okay? So maybe your goal is two months, maybe it's three months. It could even be a six month goal. So how are you gonna stay motivated every day throughout that time? You're not, and that's also totally fine. But sometimes on those days where you're feeling less motivated, you're gonna be dedicated. And I'm always gonna remind you of this throughout the next couple of letters, okay? So it's gonna be on those days that you get up Maybe you see your vision board that reminds you of why you want this because you're specific and you're clear about it, all right? So to measure this, another tip is to be accountable to somebody. Is it a friend? Is it a coach? Maybe somebody else who has a similar goal or who has already achieved a goal that you want to have. So being accountable to someone means that you want to check in with them. For example, I have a coach that I check in with every single Sunday. Now on those days where I think I'm gonna slip up, I'm reminded very quickly that I need to check in with my coach on Sunday. And that just gives me that little kick in the booty to keep going on my path. And I promise you, you never regret it, but you will regret it if you don't show up for yourself. So be accountable and use that measurable word to help you each week and maybe highlight your, your achievements, highlight your progress. That's also some self-motivation. Your next word is achievable. So the letter A, it has to be within your scope. It has to be realistic and authentic to you, align with you. Are you doing this for you? Or are you doing it for somebody else? You can be inspired from the outside world, from social media, from all of that. That's what we're all inspired by. But stay on your path, and this will remind you of your why. Why am I doing this? On, again, on those hard days, you're gonna be reminded of why you wanna do it. And if it's your goal and you own it, I promise you, you will get up and you will show up because it aligns with you. A great question that I like to ask myself for an achievable part is, will this take me where I want to go? Will this goal that I'm setting take me where I want to go? And it should be a clear yes, okay? So maybe you want to go ahead and ask yourself that as well. So stay in line with you, stay on your path. That's the achievable part, okay? Your next letter that you're going to write down is R relevant. So go ahead and write that letter down. Make sure you leave some space as well under each of these words so that you can go back over this video and start writing in if you need to be reminded. It should make sense to you. It should be realistic. Is it something that you can achieve? Maybe your dream is really big 
and super scary when you think about it. That's good. If it scares you and it excites you, just go for it. But maybe have a couple of little ones along the way that will help you stay motivated, okay? So that they're achievable. And when you achieve that particular goal, that will help you then set the next step to achieving your really big goal. All right, so it needs to be relevant now, it needs to make sense, and it needs to be realistic. Time now. I have to end on a strong one for this one. This is gonna be your last letter for setting goals in a smart way. It needs to have a date. When are you gonna achieve this goal? When? A date, a time. And I know that sounds really crazy, but if you write it down and you set it, and maybe you even tell someone, you don't have to tell everybody about your goals, because not everybody needs to understand, but you need to understand. It cannot be vague. It cannot be. You need to set that date before you even start on this journey, okay? Super important. I want you to highlight time at the bottom. Highlight that one. Go ahead, when you finish all of this, you can go back over this video and go step by step and pause it. Write down, take the time that you need, because this is important. And at the end, I want you to set that date, okay? Because that's the day that you're gonna achieve that goal. And I promise you, when you get to that point, it won't be what you think it is. The best part about it would have been the journey to that day. Have fun setting these goals. I'm excited to hear about them, so make sure you let all of us know, and I'll see you next week. If you enjoyed today's topic, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, give us a double thumbs up, and feel free to comment below on how you felt setting your new goals. See you next week, where I'm gonna help you stay motivated the entire journey.